Hi guys, hi guys, hi guys, hi guys, hi guys, it's me, the third one. And here today's video, we will... Hi guys, it's me, the third one. In our today's video, we will talk about the converse of the Hinge Theorem. Last time, meron na tayong in-upload a video with regards to the Hinge Theorem. At kung gusto mo mapanood yung ating video about the Hinge Theorem, ay ilalagay ko siya sa ating description box. At pwede mo rin siya mapanood dito. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, I'm Teacher Gon. Let's do this talk. And now, for the converse of the Hinge Theorem, let us discuss this one. If two sides of a triangle are congruent to two sides of another triangle, and the third side of the first is longer than the third side of the second, then the included angle in the first triangle is greater than the included angle in the second triangle. So basically guys, kung isipin natin, ito ah, sobrang haba kasi ng mismong theorem or ng converse. So dito, isipin nyo na lang na uh, yung reverse, i-reverse natin yung Hintz theorem at ito yung lalabas yung ating converse. Kasi sa Hintz theorem, ang kinocompare naman natin ngayon, ay kinocompare natin doon ay yung length ng third sides. Again, yung length ng third sides ng dalawang triangle. And this time, para naman sa converse ng Hintz theorem, ang i-compare natin dito ngayon ay yung included angle ng dalawang congruent sides. So let's say for example, para mas ma-visualize nyo. We have here in number 1, triangle ABC and triangle DEF. We're in, we're asked to compare angle A and angle D using greater than, less than, and equal symbol. So as you can see, angle A and angle D using the converse, kapag daw mas mahaba yung, ito ha, ito yung ano natin, ito yung angles natin, angle A and angle D. So as you can see, this side is congruent to this side, this side is congruent to this side. And yung third side nito, at ito, kung i-compare nyo sila, your BC is greater than EF. Again, mas mahaba si BC compared kay EF. Ibig sabihin yan, this angle opposite to your BC. Again, since BC is longer than EF, this angle opposite to your BC is greater than the angle opposite to EF. So, ang gagamitin natin yung symbol dito ay ito. A, e, sorry, angle A is congruent to angle D. So, paano nga po ulit nangyari? Since mas mahaba si BC compared kay EF, ibig sabihin nito, yung opposite angle ni BC, yung, which is angle A, is greater than the opposite angle of EF, which is angle D. Kaya po, ang ating statement is that angle A is greater than angle D. So let's move on with the next example para mas ma-master nyo. Yung converse of hinge theorem. Given this triangle, magkadikit sila, we have triangle A and L and triangle L and R. Sir, nasan pa mga congruent sides? Ito yung first pair. Yung A and, and, and R. Okay? And sir, nasan pa second side na congruent? Ito po. Since they are sharing with the same side, automatic the measurement of that side is congruent kapag pinaghiwalay natin. So, ang third side natin na ito, we have AL, which is 4, at yung ating LR, which is 7. Ngayon, ang kinocompare natin is this angle, angle A and L, ito po siya, A and L, and angle R and L. Anong sa kanila mas malaki? Since mas malaki, yung length ni LR compared kay AL automatic the side opposite to this side is greater than the angle again, sorry, the angle opposite to this side is greater than the angle opposite to this side which is this one so, ito yung, ang angle na to ay R and L, ibig sabihin we will be using less than symbol because Angle A and L is less than angle R and L. Ang reason, because the opposite side of R and L is greater than the opposite side of A and L. So I hope na natutunan niyo yung converse ng ating Hintz theorem at the same time yung mismong, yung mismong Hintz theorem. So sana hindi kayo malito sa dalawang theorem na to kasi napakadali lang siya. 
So if you want me to discuss some topics that you want me to discuss, feel free to write it in our comment section. So again, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, I'm Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!